In this video, I'm going to go over how to complete preventative maintenance on your Munson TMX5 luching reel. We begin by removing the drag screw and revealing what's beneath. There's six discs in there, six washers. Three metal ones and three carbon ones. And there's a carbon one. And all this system helps prevent creep. Once those are off, you can expose the innards. It's really important that these discs, when you take them out, they go in the exact same way and each disc and washer has to go in exactly how they came out otherwise you won't uh, your drag system won't work properly so you flip it upside down and you reveal six pieces we'll take a piece of paper towel and just clean those off there's also three little springs just be careful not to lose those. Those push against the drag system, so when you tighten your drag down, those push back. Here's the seventh disc. This is the fourth uh, carbon disc. I just want to make sure that those are all cleaned off. And when you look inside, we have to clean all this old grease off and then re-crease it. So I can see that this little metal fin is um, bent out the wrong way and it's not pushing the, the clicker in. So we're going to change these two around. Now you can exchange this, turn this into a right hand reel into a left hand reel and that's what these pieces are all for. So this is, uh, I have to order a new one of these. So we'll just clean this little fin up and move it to the spot. So make sure that that level pushes against your little tablet and that helps I click that. This side is broken so I'll order a couple of these pieces. You just call up a month and then they'll uh, send you these little pieces. They're pretty good about it. That's the old grease, it deteriorates after time. You gotta remember when these fish rip these uh, lines out, they, uh, they do a lot of uh, a lot of revs go in and out of this, so it doesn't take long for the stuff to break down, so that's why it's important to have her freshly greased. And... So this one's broken as well, so they get really frail. A little bit of moisture gets in there and then it corrodes. You can see, uh, so we'll call them Munson and get a couple of those orders because this one's broken. 
and that one's broken, but I don't really need them in this application because I'm a right hand wheel on this rod. Possibility of corrosion here, and this is where a lot of action happens. Grease up really well. So the other part that you really want to clean up is the shaft. So now I need to start reassembling, putting it in the back the way you took it out. These square edges align with the square edges on the bottom. These springs can break. I've had one break on one of my reels. And so, once again, just call up a Munson and they'll send you these little parts. This is the most important part of reassembling your reel. And there's this washer that has these little fins. That's the start. Then a black disc, then a washer with a square, and then another black disc, and then it repeats itself. Another disc with little fins, and then a carbon disc, and then the last disc. I want to make sure all the crud and stuff is off. If you don't put these back in order the way they came out, then the drag won't work properly. So there they have all six discs. stick in place. Just like that. Realign it. And then I do this every couple weeks in the summer when we're chartering because of how much uh, action these get. So it's important that you clean these out. Don't let them sit with moisture in them because It'll cause corrosion, although it's pretty sealed in the, in the especially the newer TMX5s. Lock that down. And then make sure you get an even pull. It's ready for the ready for the water. Thanks for watching.